What's up guys, welcome back to another Fallout 76 guide. This time I'll be showing you where you can get some copper. Okay, so our first location is Landview Lighthouse, which you can find just to the southeast of um, Vault 76. So what we're going to do is head straight into the lighthouse itself. It is patrolled by a couple of feral ghouls, but um, fortunately for us, we've killed them. So we shouldn't have a problem. What we're coming in here for is the lighthouse souvenir. So we're getting one, two, three, four, and five of those. Um, if I just quickly go into um, the junk, we will be looking at how many we get. I think it's two, yeah, two copper. We've also got one on this table. Um, I'm pretty sure there's none upstairs. Okay, so uh, now that's done, we'll just quickly head into this house which is opposite the entrance of the lighthouse and there should be a couple of um, lamps knocking about in here, if I remember correctly, as well as a few little, other little bits if you're interested. Um, yeah, there's one, uh, I'll just quickly get rid of that guy, there's one table lamp. Um, and there's the other one, so there's two in here, which we can grab. So a total of um, copper here is so you got 12 off the lighthouse, and um, I'm guessing you're going to have one, yeah, probably one off each of the um, normal lamps. So there we go. So that means we're getting 14 from this one location. Um, the what's it called again? Landview Lighthouse. Don't forget that one. So that's pretty much it for this place. Let's head on to the next. Our next location is Palace of the Winding Path. So we actually want to go into the palace for this, um, being wary of any scorched, because there should be a few scorched about. I think. No idea who that is. Oh, it's a raider. Yeah, there should be some scorch knocking about, so just be wary of these guys, but head up into the palace and we'll be collecting a few ornamental vases for this uh, this quick copper run. Um, I'm not going to show you where every vase is because it is a pretty big um, place. I'm going to go stealthy for it so that uh, we don't get caught out by these guys. Not sure if there's any on the ground floor. I'm guessing there is, but not 100%. Um, there we go. White ornamental vase. Let's have a take him out very quickly. Another ornamental vase. Now I'm pretty sure these ones have copper. Hope I'm sure. Oh no, they're ceramic. Some of them do. Just let me find out which one it is. It might just be the plain ornamental vase. Um, yeah, there we go. Two copper. So you just grab them all and check. Just double check. Uh, that's what I'll do. Because obviously we want to um, get all the copper we can. Uh, what's this? Empty floral vase. I'm guessing they don't. It's only the ornamental ones you want to be grabbing. Um, we've got a couple more of them down here. So quickly grab that Chinese ornamental vase uh, they are quite heavy so you're probably gonna get um, over encumbered by it but not to worry uh, we can scrap them okay just quickly take them guys out uh, another white one I don't think they are gonna be any good to us so get rid of the white ornamental vases guys we don't need them uh, the Chinese one weren't it I'll set one like, okay that contains a couple of copper, so it's a little white ornamental vase by the looks of things that we don't want, can head upstairs, have a quick look up there, see what's about, okay it's a white ornamental vase, we'll ignore that, um, 
Let's take this Scorched Annihilator out. Uh, yeah, but this is pretty much it, guys. You're just going to run around trying to um, grab as many vases as you can for um, all the copper you can get. Anyway, enough with the vases. The next location is Valley Galeria. So you want to head there straight over to the east. You can't miss it just below the river. Um, yeah, we're just going to run in. Enter. I'll show you where to go. So just follow my um, route. I'm pretty sure it's scorched. Yeah, scorched about. So just be careful of them guys. Um, it won't cause you too much trouble, obviously, because after all, it's only scorched. But um, let's head straight over there get in there and uh, I'll show you where to go okay so once we're in here we want to head just around this corner um, as you can see it says electronic store you want to head straight in there no messing about um, take the scorch that it's in there if it makes things easier for you and we are going to be searching the shelves um, obviously you're going to get copper from your telephones you're going to get copper from these fuses um, when I can grab one for a moment there we go and I'm pretty sure you get them from vacuum tubes I could be wrong let's just very quickly check that yeah you get one copper from vacuum tubes so um, make sure you don't miss the fuses that are uh, scattered about down here uh, toy brighters, I'm pretty sure they don't. No, they don't. So I chuck that down. Um, yeah, but I think like, three fuses, couple of vacuum tubes, and was it three phones? I think you grab off the shelves. Um, and that is probably a bait. Grab these broken light bulbs as well. These definitely got them in. And that one on the floor. And that lamp, okay, that wasn't it. <laughs> Um, I don't think there's anything down here. No, there we go. So once you've done that, there are a few other places in the um, Valley Galeria where you can grab stuff. Um, you just simply head into every shop. I think most of them have got at least a lamp in there. Um, obviously, some of them are better than others, but beggars can't be choosers. So if we're heading into this one, has it got anything? A lot of glass, but is that about it? <laughs> yeah, just glass in that one. Um, I can't really remember, to be honest, where everything is, but obviously just search the whole place. Um, and you will find stuff, but that room we're just showing you, that's the best room you're gonna find in Valley Galeria itself. Um, just keep a look out for them lamps and shit like that if you want to look around it that is uh, maybe you don't maybe I've already shown you enough maybe I haven't uh, we'll just quickly run into this other shop just um, see if there's anything else in here uh, there you go a hot plate I'm pretty sure they do um, H that's up not down pretty sure I know my alphabet there you go they got copper um, coffee part I don't think they do uh, but just keep looking guys simple as that I'm not going to show you all over the place because that's just something I don't do um, yeah on to the next location anyway anyways location that's appeared in a lot of my videos Robco Research Centre this place though it just keeps giving um, what we're going to do is head into there and believe it or not, the turrets are going to supply the copper. <laughs> Just like they've supplied a lot um, in the past. Or circuitry and that. So um, just quickly jump up here or walk around. One of the two. And um, head into the research centre and we'll show you um, where you got to go. So once you're in the research centre, we literally just want to run straight ahead. Uh, there are a few telephones you can grab off these types of desks, but um, that's not what we're here for. So we're going to head to the research wing. Um, just very quickly do a right. These guys will 
try and kill me, but luckily enough I can go invisible and hide myself from them. Uh, we're going to go into, what's it called, the research labs. Very quickly close the doors on these guys because they do get annoying. Take them out also. Um, and once we're in here, we're going to uh, head to where there is um, a few turrets to take out such as this one here so just very quickly take him out one two there we go and we're gonna get um, a few items so we've got the vacuum tubes um, I'm pretty sure we've already um, said that they contain copper and he also dropped some um, targeting card that doesn't contain copper it does contain another uh, few items that may be come useful um, now this is like an unlimited uh, type of um, copper uh, gaining technique shall we say um, you know the fuses can contain copper and I think we also got um, a circuit board of some sort military circuit board okay that's only circuit so I thought there might have been a bit of copper on there but obviously not uh, while you're in here you can grab the military grade circuit boards if you want they're going to come in handy um, there's probably a few items that contain copper as well so you might as well check them out um, just very quickly take this dude out and then we got one next to it also um, enhanced targeting card and fuse and we'll very quickly take this guy out too so I know it isn't a lot but you are um, getting copper from it and you can repeat it over and over again by hopping worlds uh, there's about four or five turrets in here that you can take out so it's not bad you can get I suppose you can get about 10 copper maximum um, but it literally takes you a few minutes to do so it isn't too bad it's just a shame we can't shoot these guys up here which I don't think we can no we can't if we could take them out it'd be even better but oh well um, that HH3A thing God knows what it is uh, worth checking but no it didn't it did not contain copper um, yeah I think that's about it guys don't seem um, to be anything lying about that obviously contains copper magnets I doubt it oh free copper from the magnet that sits on that shelf I uh, didn't expect that but there you go so if we're going to um, come in here you just got to make sure you uh, hop worlds and take these guys out as quick as you can the faster you do it the more copper you get so guys thank you very much for watching the video please drop a like and subscribe i'll see you all on the next one see you later